you're wondering what I'm listening to, it's the Inzingi diss track, Bodied by Your Body. Actually, well, do you know what? This, this has just been awkward. If anyone watching this, I'm sorry. Oh, welcome back. We, we, we really hit off with this one. Uh, now I'm going to have to clean all up this shit, but welcome back. For, I'm, I'm, I blew the confetti cannon, right? Because if you didn't know, it's the 10th episode of the Underground Podcast. Get to know. If you haven't seen the episodes, go back now. Binge watch them, yeah? We're going strong. I know you're, you're thinking, 10th episode can't be that special. It's not. Still got no one here. If you want to be a sponsor, if you want to be a guest, if you want to be a co-host of the Underground Podcast, the number two podcast in the world, obviously Impulsive is number one, it's number two, then hit that subscribe button. Come join me here. Hit that like button. Turn on the post notification bell so, never, so you always get notified. Uh, what's been happening recently? Uh, a, a lot, a fucking lot has happened. I've just come back from Spain. Barcelona is where I come from exactly. By the way, I've just got this from Barcelona as well. It's very refreshing. I also, think of that, I've left this here for a, literally a week. No one's been at home, left the plant here, still not got a name for it, for a week. Nothing's happened to it, absolutely nothing. Nothing's happened to it. Look, we can probably even spread it out. So, do you need to water plants? Probably not. Well, you do, but, you know, I mean, if this has survived the week. I hope hope you're, yeah, it's actually all right. But anyway, we've got a lot to talk about today because I've been gone for a hot minute. I have been gone for a hot minute. As you can see, the tan, like, look at that. It's got, got a big tan, big old tan on me, look, looking golden, looking fresh at the moment. Um, obviously, as we go on, the podcast should be getting better and better. I'm just waiting for that one podcast episode where we actually do have some sort of guests on. Uh, but obviously, interact with me. I might do. I might be doing live streams of this because I realised I watched Logan's 100th episode the other day and, you know, live. It was it was, it was was lit. It was lit. It had MGK there. It had all sorts. But yeah, in this, in this podcast... We're just going to be talking about a bunch of things. I'm also talking about the holiday I went on. So I went on a bit of a, I say a break, but I was still working. I went to Barcelona for a week. And obviously, as you know, views have been down. Views have dropped, man. Like, honestly, views have been down. But at the end of the day, you know, like, I've been away for a week. I didn't get to promote any videos. Obviously, scheduled videos. Like, before the holiday, Barcelona, I worked my arse off mad. Like, I was working, working, working uh, to get content so I can chill out on holiday. But even on holiday... Every day I was filming content, like vlogs for you people, uh, that will, you know, basically from tomorrow, Monday, until next week, it should be coming out all then. I think like five or six episodes of like, sort of a vlog, like a week, uh, I spent a week in Barcelona type content. Hopefully you like it, maybe it's a bit boring if you're not really about the whole vlog life or anything like that, but you know, it's just what I got up to there. Some funny moments and you know, just some cool and awesome things, I don't know what I'm saying awesome, I'm not American. But yeah, it was good. The only thing I didn't like though is, you know, the typical thing where I still thought, you know, it's nice enough weather in England. Come back to the airport, Heathrow Terminal 3, I think it was, pissing it down. It's raining once again in England. Typical English weather. <laughs> but that's why I love it, you know. It was, it was refreshing. Uh, I needed that break, but also it wasn't really a break. But I, obviously I, I spent a lot of time thinking about things. And breaks are important. I've come to realise that. Breaks are important. You shouldn't go do what I'm doing and upload every fucking day. Um of the year that's just not right but um i want to talk about as well like the content i filmed out there was vlog content that you may or may not like so hit that subscribe button if you are enjoying this content uh i haven't really it's weird it, this week has been the one week i've posted this on twitter as well where i actually haven't watched any youtube all week and normally every day i'm on point and watch about I don't know, literally 20 videos a day. I'm like always watching YouTube constantly and learning, you know, enjoying myself. But I didn't watch a piece of content there. It was refreshing. Just had to sit by the beach, you know, do fun adventures, go out on days out, go for nice meals. It was refreshing, but it was also, I miss YouTube. So sorry, my lack of knowledge on YouTube. I really don't know what the fuck's going on. Uh, probably means someone saying bath water. I've talked about last episode. I don't know what's going on. YouTube, it's weird, but also, like I said, again, it's a wonderful place. Also, I want to talk about this. Somebody, and I'm going to show footage in a second, you'll see, and it's going to also going to be a part of a bigger video I'm doing. Somebody the other day, this is before my holiday, I think last week, a couple weeks ago, I had a no-caller ID, and you, I, I, I get them quite often, so I tend to answer them because either just maybe one of my friends pissing about, or, you know, I don't know, I'm not sure who it is, so I'm going to answer it. So I answer it, and, you know, and obviously I don't know who it is, and I go, hello, they go, hello, and... You know, an English voice, it sounded like anyway. And this bloke, this man, either a rather. And he goes, who's this? And I was like, uh, who am I talking to? And he's like, no, who's this? We probably went back and forth, as you can imagine, for about 10, no, not 10 minutes. That's exaggerating. 
calm down and Ziggy. Uh, it put about like 10 seconds, I was like, no, who is this? And then I got to the point, I was fed up, I was like, if you don't tell me who this is right now, in the next three seconds, I'm gonna hang the fuck up. I literally said those words. And he goes, oh, you're, uh, he's like, he's like, um, uh, you're, you, you're in Zingy. No, sorry, he said, he first said first, you're from YouTube, like from YouTube. Like, I was born, like, you know, conceded <laughs> from YouTube. But I was like, how do you know that? He was like, you're in Zingy. I was like, how do you know, how do you know, how do you know my YouTube? And how did you, he was like, oh, I, 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 I saw you on YouTube. And I was like, okay, well, how did you get my, how the frick did you get my number then? Because this is not normal. He was like from my video, and instantly I thought this was a troll. I thought someone I knew or a YouTuber. I was like, you know, well, I was like, yeah, yeah, sure. And then he started saying some weird shit. He started saying that my that I leaked the number out. And in my head, I was like, I'm never gonna do that. Of of course, like, why would I leak my number out in my video? Like, what a cunt if you do that. But it turns out I did. I I, I think he. I was like, I, he was like, I really like your videos, man. I was like, oh yeah, cheers, bye. And I hung up. And then, I think I wasn't recording then, obviously called back, and then I recorded. But apparently, like, I look back at my videos, he said it was from the Gumtree video, the PayPal scam. And my number's there. So, everyone, I'm not deleting the video, so if you want to call me, feel free to call me. Actually, don't, because that's going to piss me off now. But my number got leaked there, by, by myself, obviously, I'm not the only one editing the videos. And it's, it is annoying me. I mean, if, it was, if I was bigger and I was on a large scale, it would have been bad. But, you know, I want to film content around that, like... Get leaking my number out and just seeing what happens just in loads of places. Obviously, I'm not big as a personality or you know celebrity or anything like that. You know, even a just micro influencer nowadays, that's what they call them. But, you know, I think it would be funny if I could try to push my number out there to as much platforms as I can. See how many people would call me and what they'd say. So, Alright, so super... By the way, I don't know why I'm wearing this. Super weird, but someone just called me on my phone. Uh, it, just, it just had a random number. I thought, I'll answer it. It must be one of my mates trying to joke me. And they were like, are you, are you the YouTube guy? Are you the YouTube guy? I was like, uh, who is this? And I was like, tell me who this is. And he was like, no, who are you? Who are you? And so I said, literally said, I'm going to hang the phone in three seconds if you do not tell me what your name is. So he's like, oh, I found, your, I found your video online. I was like, how did you get my number? And he was like, on your PayPal video. And I realised, the fuck? My, I left my number, and obviously the video is going to be taken down now. I left my fucking number on the paypal video the, the scam one the paypal gumtree one and he just called me so we're gonna call him back i'm actually gonna see what he wants like i'm not gonna that i mean it, it, it's obviously gonna be blurred but i just wanna see what this geezer wants yo yeah, yeah, so you were right, sorry. I, I thought you were someone else, but I thought you were just pranking or something. But yeah, I did. You're right, I did really leave my fucking phone number in there, which is quite yeah. dumb. But yeah, man. How, how did you find out? That's so weird. That video was ages ago. Well, not all, for me, yeah. ages ago. How did you. I saw my, I saw my homepage just came up and I Really? Wow, I'm yeah. doing bits around here then. Found on the homepage, you know. What? Are you a YouTuber? Nah, I'm just, uh, I just watch you, I'm probably, nah, not YouTuber. Yeah, not YouTuber, you watch a lot of YouTube. Yeah, but I like your videos. Hey, cheers, man, cheers, cheers. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. Right, see Yeah, it's in a bit, see ya. Yeah. Uh, I mean, what, that was the weirdest interaction, I mean, is that all he wanted to say? He wanted to call me for, just to talk to the YouTuber. Uh, yeah, I mean, if you're watching this, cheers for watching my videos. I hope you are subscribed and hit the notification bell. And like button, uh, no words, no words. But yeah, this guy, he, he, it's weird, he said that my, I said, how did you see my PayPal video? He said he found it on recommended, which means like, Google preferred is, is inbound very soon. Like, I, I'm gonna be starting making money from YouTube, not that long, maybe a few months, you know, depending if you're that subscribe button, of course, because we are, how, we are, we're not that far away, um, from you know a thousand subscribers we're on 767 now if we can boost this up let's get this to 800 subscribers by the end of this podcast please hit that subscribe button. tell your friends go on other accounts just subscribe to me tell as many people as you can about me the new upcoming best thing all right if you will but yeah the content i put out when i was on holiday it wasn't the great greatest i'm gonna be honest because I, I rushed a lot like bef the week before holiday and i was making two videos a day i actually it was weird i gained in total, I've gained more subscribers since I've been away. But then, like, the last few days, I've lost, like, what was it, four, like, 67, I was on 71, I'm on 67, I lost four subscribers. What's freaking good? But then again, I 
I need to realise that as well now that numbers don't really matter. The views matter, as in like, no, numbers don't matter anyway, but like, if you want to go technical and you do sort of care like I do and we all do, like as influencers or YouTubers or so anyone, anyone that's involved in social media all care about numbers, subscribers don't matter that much. I realise that, even from bigger influencers I said it. I think KSI so said it. I mean, everyone knows this. The views matter, but at the end of the day, if you're a subscriber and you're unsubscribing, I congratulate you because that means I'm filtering out all the toxicness, all the people that are not actually fans of me because I only want the fans to be subscribed to me and receive my content because they'll enjoy whatever I put out because of, you know, the personality that is in Zingy, you know. But then again, I'm trying to make it more uh, into, like, real and authentic content rather than, you know, this whole persona bullshit, but we're gonna get into that more. I really do need guests. Though. I need guests. I need collaborations. I've got the thing is like that's literally all I need. I need collaborations because I've got the ideas. I've got some banging million view hip hitters like videos. But and the only problem is I just need the fucking people. I need the YouTubes. I need you people <laughs> to join me on the journey and make some amazing content with me. Also, I realised as well, also, what I realised as well, from going away, like, because I haven't really been doing YouTube, like, properly like I am now, in the other years when I've gone on holidays before, but it's tough in terms of, I didn't realise how much promoting helps. You look at my views this week, 23, 25, 48, 39, 47, 39, 51. They're all my views videos this week. Before that, I'm getting hundreds, 500, like 300 or sometimes over a thousand like promoting is so essential and important for just well a mul multitude of reasons like obviously you're getting people you're getting anyone to watch your content but also it does filter because if you put in certain communities or facebook groups you get the actual target audience you want to hit whether that be you know if your kids channel you're doing i don't know a toy unboxing or your tech channel or your vlog content or your cooking channel you're actually catering towards that audience uh, which is good, but you know, I didn't promote at all, I didn't even have time to promote, uh, the videos didn't do that great, the videos weren't that great itself, if I'm being honest, and for me, so I see it, it's, it's very sad and very depressing, not depressing, but it is very, you know, but this is how I am, I'm a perfectionist in that way, that because I'm up, like, if I don't get over a thousand views, I'm disappointed in myself, quite frankly, like, and I know that might seem some people are, oh, like, okay, 100 views, that's, or 500 views, that's a lot, or 600, yeah, it's more than normal, but, I want to be getting over a thousand views for each one of my videos and for me to achieve that I need to actually be putting out good content so it's coming you know it's been a bit it's been a bit of ropes cut of curtains recently it's been a bit you know it's, it's, it's some, some stinkers of videos but it's only going to get better from here now now that I'm back on the ground working again I'm going to, the only thing is I'm doing the same thing with the content like pr producing mass batch pr content if that makes sense if not any other business minded people know what that means out there. Like, I'm going to be, like I did for holiday, postponing videos and scheduling them. Because uh, I'm going to Leeds for about a week and a half or maybe two weeks. in Sometime in August. And this is the thing I realised the other day. My, I've said all this year, my album's coming out in August. which, And, you know, I was happy to say that. And even now, I'm still, you know, half... Yeah, I'm happy to say that. But then, I woke up... I've, I've realised, sorry, last night... I was in bed, I was looking at my calendar, things I have to do, when do I have to get done by? It's 21st of fucking July. When is this going to happen then? Because I, I didn't realise, it's not one of those things you say, oh yeah, it'll, it'll be done, I'll get it done later. But you, you don't realise how close you are to it. It's coming up to Christmas practically. But no, it's it's uh, it's very close. All this is next month. Maybe I can try to get it for like 25th, uh, 25th of August, typical. But like, maybe the end of August. Or if what this is my um, this is my master plan the idea if I can't get all the songs I've literally probably wrote on my phone about fifty songs literally thirty or fifty songs but obviously not all of them, some of them are half done some of them are complete but I'm not happy with some of them are alright like I need to filter them and get the least uh, I think I'm gonna either do twelve songs in that album fourteen or eighteen like I, I, for some reason I've got OCD or things that I want it to be that because like that's usually what you get I do feel like someone told me to do twelve of my best songs but. It, I feel like it, it is that's more of an EP, like a, a a bit longer than an EP, like six, seven to twelve songs. Well, it's not the same, but you know what I mean. But you know, there's gonna be if I'm not gonna get it done in August at all, I'm going to be releasing it in, at the end of the year, like literally end of year December time, because I feel like you know what I mean. Like I just that's how I am. Like if I don't get done, something done when I want it to, like in August, it's gonna be postponed to end of year. But at least then I have more time to work on it. But do you know what? 
for the sake of just saying it, I'm not promising anything. Hopefully it should be out in August sometime next month. If it's not, I'll work extra hard to get it out end of year and it'll 100%, 100% be out this year. That's all I can say. Whether it's out in October for Halloween or near Christmas, I want it to be out and it's going to be lit because I've read as well, as well as it coming out, you know, in uh, in August, it's got to actually have music videos as well done, like at least three. And obviously the bodied one doesn't count as a YouTuber diss track. Like, like the why this happened to me and the... Um, Talk less song. Uh, that's actual. That's actual songs. Like that's actual tracks. That's not like. Even though people say the bodied one is my best song, and it's probably because it's my most recent. If I put that much energy and lyricism and meaning all that into a a track where you know it's an actual song, then I mean people say that bodied is. Like, if bodied is a song, alright, listen to it. But obviously, if I want to make a more serious song, then you know. I'm gonna do my thing, and I am recently. I'm doing my thing. By the way, this is yeah. This this might be. Do you know what? Well, fuck it. It's, it's fine. I, I mean, I thought is, is hello. I don't know how these work, but you know, it's a it's a plant. Let's just give it some more water. By the way, as well, when I was in this, I was gonna do a video uh, where I bought loads of Spanish sweets, but done the typical thing where I didn't get to buy any. But I always saw these around, and for some reason, it looks like a racist sweet. I'm not, I'm not sure if you can see this right now, but these sweets here, they're called con conguitos, and. I saw them in every single supermarket in Spain, in Barcelona, every store, every shop. Never tried them. I bought some. I'm going to give a live uh, taste test now. Uh, if vomit alert, puke alert, if you don't like watching people eat, I mean, if you're into mukbangs or, you know, ASMR, it'll be good. What the frit? What? That's not normal. That That is not normal. What is this? This looks like just li li literally, literally a piece of shit. I don't think it's it's like compiled together. I'm gonna to give it a bite of this though. Oh no! Wow. Got nuts in it. Hate nuts. GG. <coughs> I'm gonna die. I'm gonna gonna die on the set of Underground Podcast. I'm sorry. You have to. So you even have to witness that. This is a shit show, honestly. Tenth episode. We've got no one here. There's mess everywhere. I feel sick. Why have you? Why are you even watching this? No, no, no. Watch it. I need the what time? The what time is essential. All right. It just is. But you know, I'm gonna probably gonna end it there. There wasn't much to talk about. Oh, although last week, well, one thing I just want to talk this off as I never actually listened to MGK Machine Gun Ellie. Eh, Machine Gun Ellie. Wow. Machine Gun Kelly's mm. album till like. This week on holiday, because when you're on holiday, you listen to. I realize I listen to so much music. I mean, I do anyway. But when you're traveling, when you're places on the plane, I like it. Bangs El Diablo. Yeah. Um. If you haven't, if you haven't, if you listen to that song, it slaps. And that's what type of music I want to be making. And that's what I always say when I listen to albums, listen to songs. It inspires me to make more dope content and music for you people. That's what I would do. Hit that subscribe button. That's it for today's podcast. If you want to be on the set on here. DM me, um, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, Facebook, LinkedIn, MySpace. No, not the other, no last two, but all of them. You know, to you know, my socials are link in description. In Zingy, I N Z I N G H Y. Of course, your boy signing out now. Hit that subscribe button if you are joining us up for content. If you want to join the In Zingy Nation, I want to get some more merch. I also got this T-shirt. What do you think about it? Player Select. I've got this banger of a T-shirt from uh, Spain as well. But you know, I want to get some merch soon. Like the video if you did enjoy this type of content, if it made you smile, if it made you think, if it made you, you know, just interested in anything. Um, hit that post notification bell so you get notified every single time uh, I upload a podcast episode or just any piece of content because I upload pretty much everything. Vlogs, comedy skits, reactions, music, the whole, the lot, all right, challenges. But now I'm going to go pick all of this shit up, literally, uh, why do I do this? I freaking I regret my life. Thank you so much uh, for watching. <laughs> oh, this is a shit show. And see you guys in a bit. Now your vids hold no weight, like Titanic channel sinking to the ground Talking your piece on the web, karma always come around Eating up these W's, can't you see I have the crown? Feasting on you enemies, dead and buried in the ground Digging your own hole in the soil of what I found Your shit inconsistent, I don't really fuck around 
Trust and respect on my name, you playing with the hounds I've been waiting, I've been saving all these bullets, all these rounds And I wonder why this hate, all this hate don't come around I'm the king to the front of this shit, wearing the crown Flooding all you haters, you ain't shit, now you left to drown